Hello my friends, this is Vic. Welcome to my channel and thank you for viewing my videos. Today I'm visiting the beautiful country of Azerbaijan and I'm visiting the fascinating capital of the country, the city of Baku. In this particular video we're going to visit the world's most beautiful building located here in Baku and it is called the Haydar Aliyev Center. So this is Vic, let's go for a walk and let's visit the fascinating exterior of this magnificent building which was designated in 2014 as the world's most beautiful building. This is Vic, let's go for a walk, let's do it. Now in order for us to truly appreciate the magnificent design of the Haydar Aliyev Center we must uh, back up for a couple of uh, hundred meters and get a view of the building from a distance. You can see it right here how beautiful it is. Now let's go closer and let's examine beautiful design of this structure in central Baku in Azerbaijan and we're going to learn a couple of things about it. Come on let's do it. When you first arrive here and when you first get a view of this magnificent building your mouth will drop wide open. That's how beautiful it is. That's how unique and special it is. We're going to walk around and we're going to get views from different angles so that you can enjoy the beautiful design of this building. so unique I feel as if I'm looking at the Opera House in Sydney which is very unique indeed from an architectural perspective. The building was uh, designed by the celebrated and very world famous architect Zaha Hadid, H A D I D. Construction started in 2007 and it was completed in May of 2012. In 2014, this building that you see here won an award for the best design building in the world and it is now designated as the most beautiful from an architectural perspective building in the world by the London Museum of Design. So if you come to Baku you must come here and see this magnificent building. We are outside and you can see that the floor is paved, paved with beautiful white marble. What's really intriguing and very special is the exterior of the building. And uh, here's a view from the other end of the Haydar Aliyev Center. Beautiful views from here as well. This uh, building was constructed as a conference center and now it includes several auditoriums, conference rooms, museums. As a matter of fact, there is a, an exhibit taking place right now of classic cars. As a result, if you want to go inside and visit the interior of the building, 
you have to go to the classic car exhibit and you have to pay a very sharp ten dollars just for the entrance in other words you cannot just go in for a few minutes and view the interior they force you to buy a ticket for one of the exhibits what a beautiful structure indeed isn't it And uh, in, in order to truly appreciate the beauty of this building, one must walk all the way around. Every angle will give you a different view and a different perspective of the architectural design involved here. As I said in my previous segment, in order to truly appreciate the fascinating architectural design of this building, you must walk completely around. Here's a view from a different side of the building. And somehow here, right at this place I feel as if I'm walking on the roof of the Opera House in Oslo in Norway and in case you've done this you are smiling right now how beautiful everything is I don't think there is a lot more to say But the architect Zaha Hadid really designed an architectural masterpiece. The building is very, very heavily guarded by security, so I would not recommend coming here and trying to do irresponsible things like climbing on the roof of the building from places you're not allowed to do so there are so many curves on the exterior of the building that you need to pause and take it all in lot of photographs and hopefully when you get here it will be sunny a masterpiece indeed and uh, here's a side of the building which is all covered in glass and if you see any photographs this beautiful structure most likely you will see this end as well this is the trademark of the building this side now how was this building constructed well if you walk around and you look through the spaces of these metal plates here you will see behind them there's a very large strong steel frame and every plate has been specially designed and built and bolted onto the steel frame that's why it only took two years to construct this building there's no concrete involved And uh, this is it my friends, let's come back to the side of the building which is my favorite side because from here we truly have beautiful views. I hope you enjoyed 
our tour of the Haydar Aliyev Center here in Baku, Azerbaijan. Just a couple of comments. I think the idea of uh, paying $15 and be forced to go to an exhibit in order to see the interior of this magnificent structure is kind of ridiculous. It's a ripoff. And this is why a lot of people walk around the building. They come over here, they try to go inside, and they walk right outside and walk around the building. They don't get to see the interior, unfortunately. The second negative aspect is that although it was constructed about eight years ago, this whole structure really needs to be washed. Over the years, it has accumulated a lot of dust on the metal plates. You cannot see it on the camera, but it needs a good washing, pressure washing with soap, in order to get the dust off the metal plates that you see here that cover the steel frame. When it was first constructed, it was bright white, and now it's losing its whiteness. This is Vic, thank you for joining me. What a great pleasure it was to come over here. Unfortunately, we didn't get to see the building in sunshine. It would have been a completely different image. But we enjoyed it anyway. All the way from Baku, bye bye.